if the protesters at this point, uh, you know, uh, retreat and go home, uh, are they going to be getting sort of repercussions down the road? Are you going to be sort of actively pursuing the people that you've been sort of documenting and filming who are still out there protesting? What are your plans after this, uh, after the protest is over? Thank you. It's a great question. And the simple answer is yes. If you are involved in this protest, we will actively look to identify you and follow up with financial sanctions and criminal charges. We, we, this investigation will go on for months to come. It has many, many different streams, both from a federal uh, financial level, from a provincial licensing level, from a criminal code level, from a municipal breach of court order, breach of court injunction level. It will be a complicated and time-consuming um, investigation that will go on for a period of time. You have my commitment that that investigation will continue and we will hold people accountable for taking our streets over. There's a level of, of uh, admiration I actually have for China um, because their you know, basic dictatorship. For weeks, students had occupied the space demanding economic and political reforms and eventually officials had had enough. They declared martial law and the military moved in. There's a level of, of uh, admiration I actually have for China.